Okay, it's time for Face Off. How much could the Hawkeyes or Cyclones use Max Duggan? Ooh. The pride of Council Bluffs left the state for TCU. Yeah, Duggan should be in New York for the Heisman Trophy ceremony, I think. I know the Hawkeyes and Cyclones recruited Max, but maybe they needed to go harder. He's looked great all season. After blowing teams out for most of this football season, Grandview has had two close calls in the playoffs, but most importantly, the Vikings keep winning. Yeah, you often need to make adjustments in the postseason, but if you survive in advance, who knows? National Championship now just two wins away, and top-ranked Morningside is out of the picture. It's all out on the table for GV. There it is. The Drake Bulldogs are still undefeated, won the Paradise Jam, this looks like a tournament team. Prove me wrong. Look out for the dogs. I, I agree. I went to the game Saturday night. First of all, Knapp Center looks great. The renovation worked. Second, Drake might be the oldest, most experienced team in the nation. I think four of the starters are grad students. The fifth, Tucker DeVries, is the best player in the Valley. If you're in the neighborhood, go to a game. You won't be disappointed. World Cup soccer ratings are strong, and Team USA can still reach the next round I'm in as long as the U.S. is in. Once the U.S. is knocked out, I'm probably out too. You? I'm not out, actually. I still like to watch it all the way through, especially if there's an underdog country to root for. But once the World Cup is over, check back with me again in four years. Four years? Yeah. Uh, okay.